just uh, I thought you said head tops. <laughs> Let's change the storyline. Incredible. <laughs> well, this is where we slept last night. How was your, how was your, how was your retro Biffy experience? Thank you. Good morning. Welcome to another video from Sweden. Welcome to a beautiful lake of which I don't know the name. Today and tomorrow, Jan Willem yep. and I are going on a little bikepacking adventure. Made a spectacular route here with all the highlights that we could find. Uh, and we found a little hut thingy that we hope we can sleep at. So we're gonna unpack the bikes, load them with a little bit of luggage, very minimal. And we're gonna ride about 70 k's today. We just had beautiful fish lunch here in this uh, fish restaurant with fish caught in the lake. Then we're gonna ride to another lake, camp, ride back tomorrow. Should be a fun adventure. Nice bike, Martijn. Yeah, it's a little bit dirty, but that's okay. It's gonna because get even muddier. Probably, because it rained a lot last night. A lot, a lot. Yesterday, around our campsite, we wanted to get into and out of our tents. I think it was 10 centimeters of water. It was a lake. It was a lake. Yeah. yeah. So I'm curious what we'll find in the, in the forest. This is uh, how Yip always opens her luggage. <laughs> Look at this! It went into the airplane in one piece. In one piece. It came out like this. Very strange. I think one of the nice things about this ride is that it's already five o'clock. And our adventure still has to start. Just going out tonight, sleep, be back tomorrow before lunch. Yeah, it doesn't have to be uh, long, maybe, to be really adventurous. Yep, riding the Shimano version of the Atlas. Willem and I are both riding the rival version. So I have force now. I'm using a front bag for my sleeping setup. So sleeping bag, mat and liner. And then in the back I've got some food. I've got a jacket, I've got stuff that we can be able to make a little fire, campfire tonight. That's pretty much it. That's all we're gonna need. Got my camera in my hand. S'mores! Got my other camera. S'mores! Yeah, we did bring... Um, Chocolates, cookies. Snacks. Marshmallows. Yep. We have it all. Breakfast. Baby, baby food <laughs> breakfast. <laughs> this is the most compact thing that we can bring. With some apple flavor. Yeah. Got my action camera as well for when things get rowdy. Oh, and I brought a headlight. Did you bring a headlight, Jeff? No, I didn't. It's good for bike I forgot a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and we're gonna make a fire anyway, so there will be plenty of light. Feels pretty good. Maybe I'll put a little bit more pressure in my tires. But then I'm good to go.
I think we saw public sauna here and there's some bikes parked. Maximum six people. Okay, cool. Yeah, maybe we should give them some privacy. I think so. And it is also private. Ah. So was it a sauna? Yeah. Yes, it is. It's People in there. Paradise. Yeah. Maybe they live there. Naked man. Oh yeah. <laughs> There's a guy. <laughs> How fucking cool is this? A lumber mill. Yeah. You stopped mid production. Oh, this is what it is. Spinning wheel is over there. Yeah. Oh, this is really cool. Yeah. Go now. One of my joy idiot. Thank you. Pizza time. Pizza time. Pizza time. <gasps> Banana. Hawaii. Banana. Yeah. Cheers. 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 Strange beer. Yeah. It's Swedish uh, beer. Yeah. It's our next drink then. Bimelby, like Astrid Lindgren's award. Bimelby. 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 Gold. There's a documentary being made about the pizza that I ordered. It was called the Viking Boat. It's with a reason. It's with a reason. <laughs> I think this is what you call a <laughs> Are there any Italian viewers <laughs> who want to comment on this pizza? I think this is. A, we need to have a viewer discretion is advised. Uh, <laughs> No warning about, yeah. uh, before viewing this video because if you're Italian this is gonna cause you high bl blood pressure and uh, heart palpitations <laughs> this is not good for you this is a pizza but that's a margarita so that's a margarita yeah you can you can yep. look at that if you're an Italian <laughs> uh, it's getting dark it's Pizza's getting dark and cold pizzas have been eaten what does that mean I have to get to the lake mm -hmm. pitch our uh, babies pitch our babies yeah <laughs> get warm again we need some s'mores yep I will light the fire. Thank you very much, sir. I thought he said his house. <laughs> Let's change the storyline. But in Denmark, people were very unfriendly, and here in Sweden, oh. people are very friendly. Yeah? yeah? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so this is a shout out to Sweden. Exactly. And surprisingly, the sun is setting. Yeah. This is quite a surprise to me. We thought we were in uh, Scandinavia, so no sunset. <laughs> what is this? Scandinavia? Very disappointing. We've seen the gas station. You gotta love Johnson. the Johnsons. 
with uh, the local, the local Swedish shikes, <laughs> oil shikes. Oh. I bet they're gonna start an, uh, a cycling team like every oil shike does. <laughs> okay, Bivy or tent? Bivy. So is it tent? I'm going for the Bivy because I've never uh, tried it yet. No? No. I slept in the Bivy once. Uh, so I've got the, a, a grass allergy. Yeah. I slept in a Bivy in the grass. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> I can send you a photo of what my face looked like afterwards, but it was a bit puffy. <laughs> Looks like a prime location. Looks so like we found our camping spot. No. Okay, so we made it to the campsite. Also made a fire. That went quite quickly. Everything since we arrived here went quite quickly, didn't it? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Do you think about it? First uh, bikepacking experience so far. With not, not my first bikepacking yeah. experience, but oh, first yeah. one with you guys. Pretty intense. What was the intense a part? Of, a lot of sprints today. <laughs> it's just there's a lot of villages here. We can't help it. No, yeah, you have to. No, it was really nice, actually. It's really nice. Yeah? It's an experience. <laughs> Looking forward to the s'mores? That's the best wine. part. Yeah. Okay, Pizza was a good part, actually. The wine comes was a really good part. Now there's time for s'mores, so... This is not about I'm riding, happy. it's all about snacks. It's all about snacks, yeah. <laughs> How to survive snacks, riding yeah. with you guys. <laughs> okay, let's check out the eels and then uh, snacks. I don't think I've ever seen an eel alive. Pre-smoking, I've never seen an eel. No? No. Well, I thought eel would be smaller <laughs> fish. Yeah. On the menu, you could get 30 half a meter of eel. But that one is very long and thick. thick. <clears throat> yeah, the thing is, it's all about the girth. It's not the length that matters uh, when you speak about eels. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> well. Look at this fire go. <laughs> Let's go with the smalls! <laughs> That's why you don't like marshmallows. Do you because think it was too dark? It was too dark, yeah. Oh. I, I don't know about the etiquette of marshmallows. You don't want to burn them. Okay. You, want to, you want to cook them slowly. Not in Soft. the fire. Yeah. yeah it, it's, it tastes a bit... Uh, burnt. Yeah, but, but burnt. You, you don't know what a s'more is. S'mores. A s'more is no. two cookies, chocolate and a marshmallow. Really? Yeah, and the chocolate melts because of the... So let's reheat the marshmallow. Yeah, this it needs to be white, but hot. They go on the cookie. Chocolate goes on, cookie goes on top. Oh, and then you put it and on And then again? you've got a little bit of patience for it to melt. It melts because of the heat of the marshmallow. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. So, like I said, it's a little bit like fishing because there's a lot of waiting involved. Would you want to have the first one then, Martijn? No, I want you to have your own and I want to make my own. Okay. It's like a hamburger. Mm. Do you put chocolate on both sides? Sure. Do you yeah. Put, yeah? It's <laughs> like a hamburger. It's but, so fruity. But you put sauce on both <laughs> sides so of the hamburger. <laughs> <laughs> the more sauce, the better, right? Yeah. I had a lot of sauce on my biking <laughs> board. You pizza. had a lot of <laughs> sauce on your pizza. <laughs> mm. Good stuff. Okay. The chicken didn't melt. <laughs> you were, you, you you were no patient. No patient. <laughs> <laughs> I'm rethinking my life choices. This is pretty much a garbage bag. You're sleeping in this death It's truck. a plane. Yes. Why should I run in? I, 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 I might not fit. But no. this, is where, this is what I've got to deal with. Yeah. This is me tonight. Okay. But, but you do have like, the insulated. Is it a capuchon like this? Oh, yeah. You can yeah, there's, a, there's, a, there's a capuchon. Yeah. This is, no, no, genuinely, this is a very good, uh, good air mattress. It's a, a Klimt air mattress and it's, yes. uh, it's got a high R rating, so this is great. Yeah. And the sleeping bag is great. It's just the biffy that's a bit shit. Yeah, the bivy is just a garbage bag. Yeah, I've got also a bivy that I've never uh, tried before. I'm putting up a tent. Yeah, glamping. It's a bit b bigger, yeah. <laughs> but I do think it's really comfortable, so... Yeah. I'm more prepared than I look. Yeah. <laughs>
This is it gonna look like, great. You actually look like a beekeeper. <laughs> yeah. No good. Good night. Yeah, I'm still in my sleeping bag. And I'm not getting out. How was your bivy experience? The experience was great. The bivy itself <laughs> the leaves to be desired. Didn't add much to the experience. <laughs> no, 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 no. It's pretty much sleeping, like sleeping in a trash bag. <laughs> yeah. I like the no rain part. Yeah. How was your sleeping experience? Uh, better than expected. I feel like sleeping in a trash bag, but I was quite comfortable. Yeah, you, you, but you also had sort of a, a, an overhead tent. Yeah. But that doesn't really work. Okay. Because the overhead tent, it just falls down, like it's, it sits on you. It doesn't stay up. So. Yep. Yeah. You're a hero. Yeah. <laughs> very, yeah. very it's good. A, it's really nice, actually. Yeah, it <laughs> looks warm. Yeah, yeah, it's not warm, but. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice for a shower. Okay. <laughs> Made it back to the fish restaurant. Last down sign sprint. All right, time to uh, take a swim in this video. Canal Boulard. Canal Boulard. Bye. Arrivederci. Ciao. Edouard. Um, the thing with the eels is special. Um, uh, they don't know how they reproduce. Uh, they know roughly where they reproduce, but they yeah. don't know how. It's a big mystery. And they, they go through a metamorphosis. This is this is really, I'm not joking. Mm -hmm. So they, they, they come out as, they've got a baby stem, and they look quite different from grown up eels. And they, 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 they've got a couple of life stages, some, some in fresh water, a couple in salt water, or something like that. So they are not able to raise these, oh, these to just raise these fish from oh. baby fish up to adult fish, just in ponds and whatever. So they yes, don't do because they, the they, they do not grow up when they are yeah. when in they're captivity. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. So I think that they, they, they started as gla glass eels or something in salt water, and then when they migrate to fresh water, they turn into these monsters. Um, oh, they got salty water. And yeah, and something. I don't think they can artificially reproduce their 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 cycle of reproduction. So many information. Another link to Wikipedia in the bottom of this video. <laughs> JW Funk. Yeah. Eel. Eel. Wikipedia. Williams YouTube channel. <laughs> <laughs> Um, all the woods? All, yeah, a bit of wood. That's enough. Perfect. This is, this is perfect.